In this video, let's learn about the histology of the thin skin. The skin forms the external covering of the body and it is the largest organ that constitutes for about 15-20% to 20 of the total body mass. There are two types of skin present. One is the thin or the hairy skin. So the thin skin is also called as hairy skin because of the presence of the hair. And another type is the thick or the glabrous skin. For a video on the histology of the thick or the glabrous skin, you can click on the i button. In the thin skin or the hairy skin, the epidermis is very thin and it contains hair and it is found in all the other parts of the body except the palms and the soles in which the glabrous or the thick skin is present. And the thick skin or the glabrous skin in this epidermis is very thick and a thick layer of the stratum corneum is seen. It is found in the palms and the soles. And the structure of the skin, the skin consists of two layers. One is the epidermis and another one is the dermis. The epidermis is the most superficial layer of the skin that is made up of stratified squamous epithelium. And the dermis is the deeper layer and that is made up of a connective tissue layer. We will talk about the structure of the skin and the glands present in the skin in the upcoming video. And we should know the layers of the epidermis. So the epidermis consists of five layers. The first or the superficial layer is the stratum corneum. Second layer is the stratum lucidium. The third layer is the stratum granulosum. The fourth layer is the stratum spinosum. And the fifth layer is the stratum basal. It is the innermost or the deeper layer. Now let's talk about the proper histology of the thin skin and let's label this diagram. So in this diagram, this hole is the epidermis and these are the layers of the epidermis. This is the first layer that is the stratum corneum. This is the stratum lucidium. This layer is the stratum granulosum. This spine-like layer is the stratum spinosum. And this is the last or the innermost layer of the epidermis that is the stratum basal. So this hole constitutes the epidermis and this thin skin or the hairy skin has thin epidermis that is made up of a thin layer of keratinized squamous epithelium and this stratum corneum is thin whereas in the thick skin this stratum corneum is thickened. So remember in thin skin the stratum corneum is thin and the keratin layer is also thin and as you know the epithelium is the keratinized stratified squamous epithelium and in the thin skin we can note the presence of several hair follicles and the sebaceous glands with the sweat glands these all are present in the dermis so this you can note is the hair follicle and this part is the dermis this is the sweat gland these are the erecti pili muscles which are helpful in the erection of the hair follicles and in the dermis there is a presence of lot of adipocytes so these are the adipocytes and this gland that is present aside of the hair follicle is the sebaceous gland and this is the longitudinal section of the hair follicle whereas this is the transverse section of the hair follicle and we can note the presence of the blood vessels and this is the erectile pili muscles and these are the dermal papillae, those are present in the dermis and these are the epidermal papillae. The histology of the thin skin or the hairy skin is characterized by the presence of the thin epidermis that is made up of keratinized stratified squamous epithelium and the stratum corneum is very thin and the keratin layer is also very thin. The hair follicles and the sebaceous glands with the sweat glands are present and they are abundantly seen in the thin skin. And this thin skin is found in all the parts of the body except the palms and the soles. So this thin skin is present all over the body except the palm and the sole. The adipocytes are present in the thin skin. The erector pili muscles are present which are helpful in the erection of the hair follicle. This part is the dermis and this part is the epidermis with its following five layers and this is the longitudinal section of the hair follicle whereas this is the transverse section of the hair follicle. So guys this is all about the histology of the thin or the hairy skin. 
If you like this video, do subscribe to my channel. And do look at some of my recent videos and playlists.